Hey guys, so welcome to my channel. Um, this is the makeup right here that I'm about to do. Um, it is a kind of like makeup slash talk through video. Um, I'll be like t um, showing you guys the products and kind of like talking to you guys about the products or whatnot. Um, but this video, just really want to get ready because I'm going to go out tonight and go eat, go grab some um, seafood. Um, and also I wanted to do a review on this palette right here. It's called um, Guys Face Effects. Um, and it's a palette, it's a contour palette. It comes with a highlight, contour, bronzer, and shimmer. Um, and this is what the palette looks like. I'm pretty much going to show you guys what it looks like when I apply it. But the pigmentation of these colors are really nice. As far as the highlight, it's really, really nice. Um, I already applied the Anastasia Beverly Hills highlight in this makeup. Um, so I went ahead and just added a little bit of the shimmer like on my Cupid's bow, and it's really, really nice. I like it. Uh, the banana shade, um, as far as like uh, packing it on my eyelid, it blend out all my ash oils really nicely. And as far as like the light color, the light color, mm, I don't know about the like lightest uh, contour shade I really like the dark shade um, to contour a little bit better um, but yeah you guys I really like like this contour palette I'll leave it down below um, I also have yeah I also have a coupon code for them so if you guys want to go ahead and purchase it you're more than welcome um, but yeah I'm definitely gonna keep using this palette um, it's really nice and it's perfect for travel so yes you guys so yeah, hopefully you guys like this makeup look right here. Like, it literally took me about an hour and a half. Like, more than an hour and a half. Um, but all I'm wearing is like this sports bra with my jean jacket. Um, I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and eat somewhere. Um, and yeah. I don't know about the plans for today. But I'm, I might end up doing a Dollar Tree haul. I have the stuff right here. So... You guys don't mind i might be wearing the same thing in my next video and it's going to be the dollar tree um i did buy some stuff that are like brand so i'm not doing the makeup challenge i am going to actually do a makeup look with the products that i got at dollar tree because i got some great stuff so stay tuned for that video so yeah if you guys want to go ahead and achieve this makeup look right here um, to go eat some mariscos or freaking, you know, al baile and stuff, go ahead and go for it with this makeup look because this is like my go-to makeup look when I go out. Dark lip, crazy ass lashes, and my eyeshadow. Like, this is just me when I go out. So, yeah. Yeah, my beauty, so I'm back with another video, and this video is going to be a get ready with me. Um, I haven't done one of these in a while, um, so like I said, I'm going to be coming back and making more videos for you guys. Um, as you guys can see, like the lighting and everything, I kind of fixed it because I'm using my um, Canon um, camera. I'm not using my phone, so it's a big difference um, when you're using a professional um, camera versus your phone. I mean, in a way, it's pretty much like the same thing, but it kind of gives you like a pretty like portrait and amazing like lighting and just I don't know it's just perfect so I was just playing around with like my camera and this is like not a backdrop or anything I just just kind of fixing my lighting around me um and I just thought you know what it looks pretty good so why not film a video um I have a lot of stuff to film um I'm gonna be busy this week for sure and I really wanted to get ready just because I've been wanting to use this contour palette. It's um, Guys Face FX. And this is what it looks like. So it has, um, I think I've, yeah, I did put this on my Instagram and did show you guys on how it looks like. So these are the colors right here very cool tone um, browns so yeah I wanted to go ahead and so they did send this package for me just to try it and kind of review it for you guys um, so yeah I can't wait to try this out so first of all I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows um, this is pretty much gonna be like a talk through video 
and I don't know, I just haven't done one of these, so might as well. And then also be using my um, Duo Brow. It's in the powder form. To carve out my eyebrows, I'm gonna be using the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in light medium. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows and I'll be back. All right, so my brows are done. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this palette right here. I'm gonna get the banana shade. I can see um, it does set really good um, it is a contour palette but I just thought I f you know I figured why not use it on my eyes to kind of set the concealer so I use my Tarte Shake Tape um, as a base for like a primer um, I don't normally use any like eyelid primers at all I used to but now I feel like concealers are way better because I don't know, it holds a pigment of like the eyeshadow really good. And my brows are done. I know they look kind of crazy right now, but with everything, they'll be good. Oh, and by the way, I used Carmax as my lip balm because my lips are super chapped. I'm gonna go in with this um, palette from Beauty Creations, the Bredore Shadow Palette. And these are the colors. I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush and I'm just going to go ahead and start doing the crease. Um, I'm going to go in with this, um, I'm going to go in with this color right here. This. So I'm going to go in with my Morphe palette and add a little bit more orange and depth to my eyes. Um, I didn't really see like another orange in this in the Beauty Creations palette, so um, my Morphe 350 palette is always in handy for me. So I'm going to go in with Morphe palette. See this beautiful color? I'm going to go in with this orange color right here. Then I'm gonna go in with this like mauvey pink color from the Muffy 350 palette. So I'm blending all the colors out. And as you guys can see, I'm drawing it towards like my eyelid. Um, and this hair is so frizzy. Like I literally showered today. Every time I shower, my hair gets super frizzy. So I'm blending all those eyeshadows and I'm kind of bringing it down on my eyelid. So now I'm going to go with a, um, not a glitter color, but I'm going to do like a um, matte color. I'm just going to go in with my MAC Flix Plus and I'm going to go in with this darker pink color. It's like a mauve dark pink color. It's this color right here, and very intense, just by adding Fix Plus to it. I'm going to go in with this over here. I'm going to add this um, eyeshadow from the Metal Crush eyeshadow collection in Dulce. I'm done with my eyeshadow. Well, not exactly done, but you know what I mean. Um, I'm gonna go in with the Dose Cosmetics Eyeliner in black. And I'm just gonna go ahead and tight line underneath my eyes. Next thing I'm going to use is um, Professions Beauty Rewind Rose Hip Oil. Um, just so my face could be super dewy. 
um, well, actually not too dewy, but my face tends to be, like, on the dry side. Lately, it's been really dry, so. I've been trying to, like, take care of my skin really good. I don't know why, but I'm probably be getting, like, some type of reaction to like a foundation that I've been using I don't know but sometimes I get like really um, bad breakouts like pimples I don't know what it is but whatever I think I'm gonna use is this Farsali highlighter in jelly bean I see a lot of people I see a lot of youtubers use this um, highlighter so I'm just gonna go ahead and use it And lately, I've been using my Maybelline 24 Hour Foundation. It's the full coverage, um, super safe foundation. Love this one, and I got it in Warm Dew. Then I'm gonna use my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. So far, the best concealer I've ever used. I already set my face with the Laura Mercier powder. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the guy, guys face effects palette. I'm super pumped to use this honestly. So I've been tr like wanting to try this, but it just doesn't happen. But now I'm here reviewing this. There's a shimmer shade right here, there's a bronzer. There's a contour and a highlight. I'm gonna go in with a fluffy brush, just a regular brush, and I'm gonna go ahead and use, I'm gonna use a lighter color right here. And I'm gonna go in with this. I'm gonna go in with this darker color right here from the palette. So the next thing I'm gonna do is put some eyeshadow underneath my eye. I kind of was working with this um, eye. So I'm gonna go in with the Beauty Creations palette. From the same palette, I'm going to use this shimmery color on the inner corner. I'm going to add some Fix Plus. I'm gonna add some Fix Plus. This is just to give me that dewy finish. Since I already added my highlight. Ooh, yeah. So lastly are my lashes. I usually like putting my lashes and then like my highlight, but I'm gonna rush right now. So yes, I've been doing my makeup for the past hour and a half. So this is from the MUA collection from Rootwear Collections. These I always wear the bottom on my Instagram, YouTube, when I do my makeup, um, I always wear these. I like my dramatic lashes, and these are my favorite. These are the MC01 lashes, and they're so fluffy. I'll link it down below so you guys can get your pair, um, but that's what they look like. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my lashes now. I love using my House of Lashes glue. It works awesome, like so good. 
So that's how one lash looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and apply the next one. Um, these are real mink lashes and the lash band, it's a little bit thick, but you know what? I've always, like I've learned to apply lashes with thick bands and it's okay for me. If you don't like that type of style of dramatic lashes and don't get them, I'm just like letting you guys know that like, the girls that actually like wearing lashes like this, very dramatic. This is my type of thing. Like I love dramatic lashes. Obviously, you know, if I'm gonna go like, to a family party or something, then I mean, family parties I usually kind of wear my dramatic lashes still, but um, it's if it's more like, you know, classy type of parties, and I won't, I won't kind of bring it down the notch and not bring it. I went ahead and added this like dark purple color underneath my eyes to just emphasize the eyes a little bit. Honestly, I love this palette. Like, I've used it multiple times and I love it. Um, some of the shadows. Um, do kind of come off um, like powdery a little bit but not too much but as like the pigmentation I love it pretty much done already um, so I'm gonna go ahead and apply my lipstick and I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of the bronzer from guys um, face FX palette and I'm gonna use that dark um, dark color right here and I'm just gonna apply it on the hollows of my cheeks because I feel like I didn't add enough bronzer so I don't really feel like the purple was giving me like the vibes from the eyeshadow so I'm gonna add Ashton which the Anastasia liquid lipstick and I'm just gonna apply it So I wasn't really feeling the liquid lipstick. Um, it's a pretty color, but just with the look, I just thought, why not use like a dark color? So I used the color in Ashton, which is a beautiful color. I was gonna use another one, um, just because I've been using that color Ashton for like maybe two months already when I go out and stuff, because it's really dark and it has like a tint of orange to it. What I'm going to do next is get my highlighting brush and I'm going to apply, um, I know I applied the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighter but I actually like saw the palette that I received um, and I'm going to try the um, shimmery highlighter from the palette and see what it's all about. Um, so I'm just going to apply it over top. Um, I actually applied it right here like where my lips are at and it's really really nice like I already applied it right here look how that applies it applies really nicely on the skin so yeah I'm going to apply some right here completes the makeup look already um, I'm going to go ahead and change and hoops um, as far as these little ears I just did this for the purpose of the video of me doing makeup so I'll be right back okay, so I went ahead and applied my hoops and my jean jacket I'm about to bounce um, I curl my hair um, I need to curl it once again just because my hair is so freaking frizzy and the climate right now outside it's like very like nasty outside guys like so this completes the final look right here. Um, you guys can see my eyeshadow. I'll, um, I'll go ahead and insert some pictures on my Instagram and obviously like my IG um, TV videos. So watch out for those. Um, and also I'll be making more makeup videos if you guys want that. Please give us a thumbs up. Please turn off your notification. That way you guys get notified when I upload. Yeah, you guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.